Aloha and welcome to week three, day three of Song of Day. Hope you're all well. Uh, day 13 in total and um, absolute cracker for you today. We're off to see the wizard from the wonderful Wizard of Oz. Here we go. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow, 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 follow the yellow brick road. Follow the rainbow over the stream. Follow the fellow who follows a dream. Follow, 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 follow the yellow brick road. Okay, right. Let's get into it. So the first thing you'll be aware of, uh, or you might not, but I'm going to make you aware of them, is uh, all these dynamic changes here. So you've got uh, letters like MF and MP, P, F, and little crescendo markings here. And that means uh, essentially it's directing your volume, directing your dynamic. And so MF stands for mezzo forte. So for now, uh, let's just reference it in terms of your normal vocal volume. And you kind of MF would be mezzo forte. So mezzo forte means moderately loud. So just go a little bit louder than than your normal volume. Um, and let's see if I can find some more. Mezzo piano means moderately quiet, so moderately soft. Um, so again, from reference of your normal vocal volume, bring it down a touch. Piano means soft. And F for forte means loud. Now these little markings here are crescendo markings, and that means over that wherever the crescendo goes from and to, you're to gradually get louder over that point. So here it's just on the one word we're, and then uh, there's another one down here over two two bars. It means gradually get louder over those two bars. Okay, uh, but most of all, just have some fun with it and have a play and just see what you can do with your voice and just kind of explore what you can do dynamically. Here we go. Okay, right, let's have a look at the chorus. So uh, chorus is um, uh, is forte, so that means loud. Okay, so you're going to go from, we're off to see the wizard in forte, the wonderful wizard of Oz. We hear he is a whiz of a whiz, if ever a whiz there was. Put your teeth in for that one. Then we bring it down just a touch in dynamic. If ever, oh, ever a whiz there was, and then we bring it down again to mezzo piano. The Wizard of Oz is one because. Now here, you're going to have to grab a breath somewhere because there's nowhere in the markings for you to breathe. And also, you you need to um, control the dynamic here in terms of crescendo. Um, and in order to, to change alter your dynamic correctly, you need to make sure that you're breathing well. So that's really important that you grab a good breath somewhere. So let's go from the chorus. We'll go, give myself a couple of bars in. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. We hear he is a wizard of a whiz, if ever a whiz there was. If ever, ever a whiz there was, the wizard of Oz is one because, 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 because of the wonderful things he does. Good, right, you have a go at that, here we go. So that last bit, you've got a little piano run down there, and um, and then you've got, we're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. And you don't need to hold the last note too long. It's only a dotted crotchet. Um, so, yeah, don't need to hold it too long at all. Right, I shall say goodbye, and then I'll give you a full run through so you can have a good old sing song. Hope you're all well. Hope you're looking after yourself. Hope you're looking after each other. And I shall see you tomorrow for day four, I believe of week three, I've lost track of the days. Here we go. Mm -hmm.